What's up guys, this is Micro from Micro Reacts coming to you with another reaction video. It's been a while. I tend to say that a lot these days. But um, I've been pri 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 prioritizing. That's a hard word. Pri prioritizing my band without warning because we have a gig coming up next week and I've been practicing a lot and just preparing myself for that. And we have a second gig coming up next month as well. So I'm also rehearsing for that one. And then I have some extra stuff to do. So I've been putting my band first for a little while. And talking about my band, let me show you something here. So we have our official merch out now for Without Warning. And I'm actually wearing the t-shirt very cool design done by me um yeah so we finally have official merch and as you can see we have a black and a white hoodie we have a black and a white tee and then a tote bag so if you're interested in getting your without warning merch you can order it from the link below um, we have worldwide shipping so anybody can get those and the price is really good it's the lowest we could sell them for but yeah so that's on my band so let's jump into today's band which i'm really excited for ghost now ghost is quite a new um band for me in a sense that um i didn't use to listen to them on a regular actually not at all I, I know about Ghost I know the name I've seen the guys and but I've just never listened to their music since or I mean the first time since I really stumbled upon them when was when they released their song Spillways and I reacted to it and that was my first kind of official ghost experience and I was so confused because in my mind from you know seeing ghosts on social media and stuff and never listen to their music I, I thought they were a black metal band or something I don't know I was expecting something very very harsh and then it was very light metal almost more of rock music very melodic and just I, I was so confused but i loved that song spillways is still my favorite song from ghost since diving into the world of ghost and listening to their other stuff and now they have a new song out or at least a new music video um the song is called jesus he knows me and something that i like about the theme that ghost has with those outfits and what is very much also heard in the lyrics uh, Tobias who is the founder and singer and composer for Ghost is incredible and the way he uses lyrics and it is just wow multi-talent guy Swedish by the way the band is Swedish um so yeah uh, <laughs> you can expect anything from Ghost but I think I've said enough because I really want to get into the song so without further ado let's listen to Ghost with the song Jesus he knows me let's go give me an amen and I love those characters damn right amen the Lord's coming for us but he's only coming and their humor it's great yeah, yeah, yeah. Thank you. The Lord thanks you. Jesus loves you. And Jesus loves your donations. Thank you. Seven. Jesus, he sees your promise. In heaven, it's yours. For those who do it. Thank you. Thank you, brothers and I sisters. I mean, it's Thank quite you, accurate. <laughs> Singles, okay. Bribe it. You're officially defrauded. <laughs> All right. Holy hits. That's a toy car, is it? No. 
to look like a toy car. Ooh, nice guitar. Oh, the bass. <laughs> Jesus, is that cute? You see the face on the TV screen coming at you every Sunday. You see the face on the billboard. That man is me. On the cover of the magazine. There's a question why I'm smiling. Buy a piece of paradise and you buy a piece of me. I'm like, that's not sugar. <laughs> Crazy. <laughs> Let's just take a pause there. Okay, so it's very crazy. Um, Tobias sounds great. I love um, the instrumental part with all of the instruments. The bass really kicked in, and I don't know, they always have such a great sound. Um, Tobias comes up with the craziest things but still he's the master of producing catchy stuff I, I i think every of their songs have a catchy part and that's that's a really good thing um his voice is just super super cool the, um, the theme of the video <laughs> um in the beginning it kind of gave me that you know that typical preacher who preaches on Sunday and yeah well does this or is just overall has that double morals lifestyle and just you know there's a lot of preachers and people in in faith that definitely use their status and definitely use their power to abuse people and <laughs> I mean, I could dive into this for a long time, but um, obviously, well, it's not the first time Ghost kind of makes fun of Christianity and their whole, you know, identity of to be as alter ego. I, I can't remember what his character is now. Uh, he's had a few, but it obviously mocks the Catholic Church and stuff. And you're so used to seeing... Well, it's, it's very common in metal music to mock faiths, especially Christianity. And in black metal or death metal, it's very brutal. It's very, you know, aggressive. But then Ghost does it in a kind of humorous way. And and I think that's that's a really cool thing. I'm not, I mean, you shouldn't mock anybody. I'm not a, belie a believer myself, but I, I think... He somehow, well, you can be offended by this, obviously, or then you can take it with a pinch of salt, with a pinch of sugar, sugar, sugar I don't know what's the saying in English, um, but he, do, he does have a point very often, I think so, <clears throat> but okay, let's, let's continue. I like that ghost logo, it's super cool.
<laughs> okay. And this song is so uplifting in its melody. goes with the song Jesus he knows me uh, wow okay that was quite intense <laughs> with the story he definitely the priest had a <laughs> wild weekend <laughs> okay so um, I think the song really had catchy tunes very well produced I do think, though, that they could have done just a little more to bring the song some variety because it, it kind of felt like it was repeating itself. Maybe on purpose, maybe to kind of emphasize the st story that everything is just looping around. Um, but just production-wise, because I know they are capable, he, Tobias, is capable of producing even, you know, interesting stuff so just a little more variety I'm going with that um, but still I think the song was super fun <laughs> and just uh, yeah so uh, the funny thing definitely is that these songs are quite uplifting just as spillways which actually talks about a quite serious topic but it's it's just presented in such a uplifting happy way it's just it's just crazy they that concept of ghost is just so funny but so good um ghost is actually attending or or um playing this summer at the biggest metal festival in finland tuska in helsinki um this year so i will be seeing them live for the first time and i'm very excited about that I want to see the goals and everybody. So yeah, that will be cool. Um, I will probably be listening to this song. I think it just needs a couple of times. I was focusing so much on the music video because it was just crazy. Um, but a very catchy tune. Yeah. Let me know what you guys thought about the song. Have you heard of Ghost before? If you have, what's your favorite song? Please do share. I want to know some details. Oh, uh, yeah. But that's for today. I'm super awkward for some reason. I'm very sorry. And if you're interested in buying yourself some Without Warning merch, please do check out the link below. Um, the site is called Uno Mas. Um, so you'll find all the details there. So thank you for joining me, and I will see you in the next video, guys. Have a great night. Mm.